Correct postures by Dr. Himakshi Basu, famous physiotherapist to all the celebs from Katrina to Rithik to Bipasha. Check it out. Hi guys, this is Himakshi Basu, a consulting physiotherapist and a movement specialist. Uh, today I'm doing a little video on a short, simple exercises how you can save yourself from any injuries, uh, whether it's a neck, whether it's a back or the shoulder, in continuation to my talk with Pala on Radio City. So here I'm going to describe these few exercises. As we all know, we are in lockdown period, so we are constantly either sitting in front of our screens, whether it's big or small. And how do we do that? Nice and slouched and looking into our screens or into our TV screens or the computer. So this is what we are going to do. Our head is forward, back is slouched and there we go sitting like this for many hours. So what do you expect? We are going to get injuries. So these are the few exercises which you can do. As I mentioned in the talk, your head is forward, so you need to move the head from forward to backward, right above the shoulder. All we need to do is glide your neck back a couple of times. That's the first exercise you can do to avoid neck injuries. You can also move the neck sideways to maintain the mobility of the neck. All of these can be done three to five repetitions a couple of times every couple of hours. It's important that we do not turn whilst we are in the forward head posture like that and like that. Can you see how horrible we look? So it's important that we look nice and straight and exercise in the right posture. Second, your shoulders are nice, rounded, upper back is rounded. All you need to do is pull up your shoulders and your upper back. So smile with your shoulders, keeping it in an upright position. There you go. Hold a couple of times and relax. Smile again and hold a couple of times and relax. Take your hands behind your neck. Stretch your elbows back. Feel the stretch in the upper back and relax. Feel the stretch in the upper back. Relax. Repeat one more time and relax. So that takes care of your neck and your upper back. Now, the low back. We are going to be in this position. So we need to stretch always in the opposite direction. So what are we going to do? We are going to, if you are sitting, we are going to rock our pelvis in front and rock back. Rock in front, rock back. Rock in front, rock back. Just do a couple of times. Or you stand up and arch backwards. And how do we do that? Get up. Put your hands behind your back and stretch. One. And back. And back. Then you take care of your low back. Now, the hip, which is the fourth part. The hip and the knee is also important to make sure that we loosen them up. We are constantly sitting, either we are sitting in this position or we are sitting cross-legged on the chair or on the sofa or on the floor. So we tighten up at the hip, we tighten up at the knee. What do we do? Simple. Stand up again. Okay. For the hip, important to walk a couple of times so that loosens up the hip. We can also uh, make sure that you're, when you are doing the back arches, it will also stretch the little bit of the hip too. Knees. How do we loosen up the knees? All we can do is just do a little spot job, which will really help. Or drop the knees back and forth. Or go down and up, down and up. Just a little bit to warm up the knee and loosen up the body. These five exercises or a few of the other additional exercises you added will really help. What I really like to add is some circulation in the legs. So if you can just do a few calf raises where you lift your heels and down and you lift your heels and down, what does it do? It will help us improve the circulation in the calves and pump blood 
to the heart and keep you nice and warm. So all this will help in opening up all your muscles and you will feel nice and loose instead of being completely locked up in the belly posture. I hope this tips really help. They are simple, short and sweet exercises all can be done by yourself at home, anywhere, anytime. So do enjoy, do try them and see how it works for you. Just a small note, if you think that the exercise is aggravating your pain or it's producing a new kind of pain, as far as the pain settles, it's not a problem. But if it does continue, please consult your physician or your physiotherapist before you continue with the exercises. To have a look for these videos, uh, more, more such videos, please follow Radio City and Midday so that you can enjoy simple exercises done at home. Stay safe, stay at home and stay healthy. Take care.